Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to fix Windows activation error code that is 0xc004f050. So if you're receiving this error code, then please follow the steps shown in this video. Now the first step is to run activation troubleshooter. Now for this, when you receive the error, activation error, in front of it, you will see troubleshoot option. So you can click on troubleshoot and once the troubleshoot is complete, you can check. Now you can even type in SLUI in run box so type in run in windows search box and in the run box just type in SLUI and then click on OK it will take you click on yes to allow and then it will take you to windows activation settings page and over here if you see troubleshoot option click on troubleshoot and then activate your windows now the next step is to try change product key option now for this you can again type in s l u i in run box so type in run and then type in s l u i and over here click on yes to allow and then you will see an option which says change product key so you can click on change and then if you have the product key available with you you can write down the product key over here and then click on next and then activate your windows now in case windows 11 or windows 10 came pre-installed on your computer and you don't know the product key in that case you can use this command in powershell to check your product key so you can copy this command this command is provided in the video description so copy it now once you copy it type in powershell in windows search box and then make a right click on windows powershell and then click on run as administrator make sure that you always run powershell as an administrator click on yes to allow and then paste the command over here and then hit the enter key i will not hit the enter key because it will show my product key so when you hit the enter key you will see the product key over here now once you see the product key so after you put the command hit the enter key and once you see the product key now you can go to change option and you, you can enter that key and then click on next and then try to activate your windows now still not activating then the next step is to run these command these commands are provided in the video description type in cmd in windows search box make a right click on command prompt app and then click on run as administrator always open command prompt as an administrator click on yes to allow and then copy all these commands one by one paste it in the command prompt window hit the enter key run the second command now run the third command now run the fourth command now run the last command and then once this is done now restart your computer restart is a must and after the system restart you can try to activate your windows now still not working the next step is to run this command this command is also provided in the video description so copy this command type in cmd in windows search box make a right click on command prompt app and then click on run as administrator always open command prompt as administrator paste the command paste the command over here and then hit the enter key and here you can see product activated successfully and then you can check still not working you can use phone activation so in this case you need your cell phone or phone so now type in run in windows search box and then click on run and in the run box type in slui4 without any space and then click on ok i'm sorry you have to give one space here so it's slui space 4 with after slui space then number 4 and now click on ok now you have to select your country so make sure that you select your country so in my case it's india so i will select india now click on next now over here you have to call this number so whichever number you see as per your region call this number from your phone now once you call the number just follow the ivr and then it will be asking for your 
installation id so enter all these installation id make sure that you don't make any mistake when you enter the installation id on your phone so just enter the installation id if it is, if it is asking for installation id enter the uh, enter the installation id and then click on enter confirmation id now the phone will give you confirmation id so once you receive the confirmation id from the phone it will be automatic ivr which will be giving you confirmation id so enter the confirmation id over here and then click on activate windows and then that should help you to activate windows now still not activating in that case use this command you can use command prompt to run this command now type in cmd in windows search box once again make a right click and then run as administrator this is important click on yes to run now over here you have to copy in this case xxx these are your license key so you can just copy from here it's slmgr then space dash ipk this command is provided in the video description you can copy it paste it over here and then after this ipk there is i think there is one space there is one space and then you have to enter your license key so if you have the license key you can write down the license key and then hit the enter key now in case windows 11 or windows 10 came pre-installed in that case you you can get the product key from this command you can again type in power cell in windows search box make a right click on windows power cell and then click on run as administrator click on yes to allow and then paste the command over here hit the enter key you will see your product key over here I, i'm not doing it but when you hit the enter key you will see the product key now once you see the product key after this command you have to write down the product key and then hit the enter key so this command after this enter the product key hit the enter key now once you hit the enter key now once you put the product key hit the enter key once that is done after that you have to run this command on the same command prompt window where you have ran this command along with the license key so now i will not my command is incomplete so please ignore this now on the same window run the second command this command and then hit the enter key and here you can see product activated successfully now once this is done restart your computer now still you are unable to activate your windows in that case you can install windows 11 or windows 10 using usb flash drive so i made a separate video on this how to install windows 11 or windows 10 using usb flash drive now when you install do a clean installation using the usb flash drive you will lose all the data and application on your computer so make sure that you create a backup and then you go for clean installation now how to do a clean installation of your windows uh, you can go to this link the link is provided in the video description now once you open this link i've made a separate video on this here you can see how to install windows 11 using usb flash drive the steps are same for windows 10 users so just you can follow the steps from this video and then you can after clean installation you can check still not activating in that case you can contact microsoft support in that case you can open this link the link is provided in the video description it will take you to microsoft website and then you can select windows and then for if it is home support you can select home support and then you have to log in with your microsoft account make sure that you are logged in with microsoft account and then you can type in windows activation whatever is the activate windows and then it will search if you have windows 11 you can select windows 11 or you can simply on the bottom here you can see contact supports you can click on contact support product and services select windows you can confirm and over here you can see provide your phone number and support agent will call you so you can click over here and then you can provide your phone number you can select your country enter your phone number confirm 
and they will call you and they will help you to activate windows so one of the steps shown in this video should help you to activate windows 10 or 11 successfully on your windows computer so that'll be all thank you so much for your time and please like this video and subscribe to my channel so one of the steps shown in this video should help you to get rid of this error so that'll be all thank you so much for your time and please like this video and subscribe to my channel